it's Sarah. I have something a little different. I am going to be talking about my Schifflera plant. I've been watching a lot of plant videos, you guys, and I am, am focusing on plants because as part of my serenity, my serenity journey, um, I'm including plants. I think they make you very present. Um, not only are they just beautiful and you're bringing the outdoors in and nature into your home. Um, you know, I, I've never been a big gardener, but I have always had house plants. Nothing major, just like, I mean, most of them have been pothos, um, philodendrons, the ones you really can't kill. And this guy, he's probably like two years old or three, two or three, I want to say. And he's doing great. I've moved him around the house a lot. Um, the thing he's in here, it says highlight, but I mean, yeah, I guess he was mainly in the back room and there's a lot of windows in that room. But I want to try and show you this. I'm tipping without. There are, only, there are four trees, like four trunks that come out of the pot and there's really nothing else in there like it's four main trunks and then they all kind of are their own plant so my question is for all of you planty people what would you do because I wasn't paying attention to it I was just letting it grow I didn't realize that it like needed to be pruned or I should have been pruning it or guiding it because I know that they make you can do bonsai trees with Schifflera if you prune it the right way. So they're very um, prunable to get to go the way you want. Now, I went to the one of our local nurseries, which I was very disappointed because she didn't even help me. She's like, yeah, you could do that. But like, I wanted her to like say, oh, you know, here's what you should do and whatever. Kiwi, you wanna come? Um, so that didn't work, but I'm kind of thinking there's several approaches I could take. I could probably, and I'm very, um, I'll be patient and wait and see what you guys say. But I feel like I could just dump the plant out of the pot and I would be able to propagate it that way, kind of make four different trees. I could just separate out the stems. I'm not positive, but I'm, that's probably likely that I could do that. Or I could make two plants out of it. I could put two of the stems together and then start a new pot that way. Um, what I'm really curious about though is if I pulled off all the bottom leaves off the stalk and made it like one trunk and like kind of braided them together and then started like, could I do that? And I, I mean, I've watched a lot of Schifflera videos and no one's really talking about that. Um, maybe I need to watch some bonsai ones, like literally the bonsai ones, because I haven't really watched those. I just know that there's, I've skipped over it, but I've seen it anyway. Um, because he's really cool and he's doing well. And like I said, I haven't really paid much attention to him. Like no specific water regimen or sun he's moved all over because we just got new furniture so i had to move him again now he's like on top of a um ikea cubicle thing um in that same room but he's doing so well and i did get this new pot let me show you this pot i want to show you this this was like eight bucks this is probably like an eight inch pot Better Homes and Gardens from Walmart. Walmart has, the, the, they even have terrariums. They had, I went in there and I was like shocked at all the really pretty, pretty, not shocked, but reasonably priced pretty stuff because for the most part, I've been getting most of my pots since I've really started investing. I redid this room. The, I have the room I'm in now, I consider it the Zen Den. And I, I, I had a kind of a picture of a lot more plants, a little boho. It's kind of not boho because I used what I had. I don't know. Anyway, um, I've got quite a collection. So, um, like I said, I've been watching lots of plant videos, and um, I. But I, I, instead of keep buying more, I'd like to get to know the ones I have, and so that's my goal for this guy. Um, so, just in the comments, let me know um, if you know of a video that that answers the question or if you have had experience with the Schifflera and done 
something similar to yours. Um, because yeah, I think it would be really cool to kind of braid, or not braid, but twist, maybe braid, twist the chunks together and then kind of make it into a tree that has like a, tr a, a trunk and then a tree at the top. Because right now, I mean, obviously you can tell, it's just, they're like four things sticking out of the pot. So I want to do something with it. All right, you guys. Um, that's it. I hope you're having a great day. Thanks for watching.